Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about your go high level account and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you suspend a go high level sub account? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to suspend one of your go high level sub accounts anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running an online business, you know that sometimes your sub account or your customers don't pay the bill. So rather than just deleting their account, you can actually suspend them until they pay and then you can manually reactivate it. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your Go High Level Agency dashboard. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well. But I've already logged into my Go High Level Agency dashboard and this is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, in order to suspend or deactivate one of your customer's sub account, here on the left side, click on sub account. Once you do that, you will see all of the sub accounts you have in Go High Level. You can see I have these two right here. And once you found the account you want to go ahead and suspend, click on manage client. Okay, so once you do that, it's going to show more information about your client. And in order to suspend or deactivate their account up here on the top right, click on action. Once you do that, you're going to see these four options. So generally, if you need to suspend them, you're going to do one of these two. If you know that they're not going to pay you or they're no longer going to reactivate their account, then you might want to go ahead and just delete the information. However, if you simply want to suspend their account so you can reactivate it later once you receive payment, go ahead and click on this one here, pause sub account. Okay, once you do that, go high level, ask if you have permission from your client to do this. So click here and once you do that, go ahead and click on pause sub account. Okay, so now if they have any kind of phone campaigns, they are letting you know that you want to go ahead and disconnect and close out those phone accounts because you will still continue to incur charges if they use that service. This is just a test account, so that wouldn't apply. So I'm going to click here. And then in order to suspend this customer, click on pause sub account. Okay, so once you do that, the page refreshes and you're going to see this red headliner up here. It says this sub account is paused. Your clients can't log in, but you can through the agency. And then if we click right here on sub account, okay, it brings me back here. And as you can see, the sub account is still here. It's just not active from the user side. It has been suspended until they make their payment. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to suspend or deactivate one of your go high level sub accounts, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.